Guten Morgen, Russian Swine Today, I interview an EOD specialist, but before that, some highlights from the previous streams, which you can catch down below at my Twitch channel. Alright, let me go. Let me out of Let me out of I'm dead too. Oh, I killed him. Ah, oh, fucking. <sighs> oh my god. Explosive seal, not this seal. It's fucking confusing. <laughs> yeah, I, I thought you were, I thought you were gonna say we have multiple seals, so I was like, oh no, here we go clubbing again. We have multiple seals. Oh no, here we go to Afghanistan again. <laughs> oh, we're in the fucking, the good, the, the loot, the high loot. Place, right? The loot! Oh, no, I haven't played Factory in so fucking long. Yo, you want, uh, words are hard. This box here is like the best. It's 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 actually it's dog shit. It's like the worst box. There's like nothing. Go <laughs> <laughs> down there, player. Reloading. Oh, he's run off. Uh, I'm following. Oh! What the fuck? <laughs> uh, I'm following. Oh! What dead? the fuck was that? Oh, <laughs> oh I'm down dead. Got him. Oh, did I just kill you? You killed me. <laughs> I don't know why, but this scav is absolutely kitted out. He's got like a suppressor, a backpack, a decent rig. I got it's a rocket. hat. I got like swimming goggles. I've got like one of those safety vests, a fanny pack. Hey, you're like, you're ready for war. <laughs> I'm ready to run away from war. I don't play with viewers. I play with observers that are in constant superposition. If you talk to them and you're looking at them, they're there, but like once you ask them to come, they just disappear. These dudes really be acting like a particle rather than a wave. Yo, can I get infinite points so I can spam? I wonder if things? I wonder if I actually can give me give you points. I just I just want I just want power. It's not power, mate. It's a burden. I uh, point. It's like saying, yeah I'm gonna hold in my piss because it gives me power, like <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be one of them streams, boys. <laughs> <laughs> that is an awesome laugh. Just laugh. I don't know, whoever made There were a lot going on. Car noise. <laughs> yeah, that. <laughs> <laughs> that is not a car noise, that is- oh, Everyone's man. just afraid to laugh suddenly. Afraid of <laughs> Kelp's judgement. I'm on, uh, I'm on that. Discord noise cancellation, so you can't even hear me laugh. Discord doesn't pick it up as a human sound. Oh, 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 oh my god. It was to give it. Oh, I didn't fucking get my laser in this. Jesus. Can I have a laser? So I have a laser I could put on my gun, please. I have a laser that I could just fuck my forehead. A mongoose. A moose. Yeah, yeah, they're coming. I, I need to heal up. I need to heal up. Sounds like a stream to me. The movement. It's it's a guy with TTV in his name, and it's a Chinese name. Which, no. Wait, it's okay. I sold my liver. I can buy it. <laughs> Selling my IRL body parts to buy guns in Tarkov. <laughs> That's a good video idea. That's a good yeah, video idea. <laughs> is it, is it really? Him. Is it really? Guys, to today I'm hospital. going to sell how, all my parts. Are you, how much are you giving for parts. this liver? Sir, we wouldn't even refund you for this. <sighs> this shit busted. Like, you're like in a hospital bed with yellow eyes, and you're like, oh, at least I got that Alton. Uh. <laughs> and they're like, we, we can give you an SKS for that one. <laughs> it's like Tarkov oh, drops. Oh, fuck, don't oh, start. Your penis is both the size and the worth of a 9mm. Oh, <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Beg your pardon? In Hang US on. economy, uh, that's yes, pretty same. expensive. It depends on what type of round it is. You know? yeah. Is it AP? Yo, the piss. Lanks. <laughs> Lanks. <laughs> Lanks. <laughs> <laughs> You're Who's a an analyst? analyst. 
Who's an analyst? Let me perform. Let me let, let me perform an anal. <laughs> a, 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 a fucking what? <laughs> so you diffuse. You used to diffuse bombs, right? Uh, diffuse, detonate, or dispose of yeah. But sometimes there's like uh, high traffic civilian areas where they're literally targeted. Uh, uh, yeah, that's that's like the only times because the civilians they even though like we technically have authority there, we can have local police coordinate. They they won't. They usually won't give a shit. They're like bombs. That's chill. Bombs. J jaywalking. Yeah, Get the fuck okay. out of here. <laughs> nah. A woman without a hajib? Of course, the military is like one of those places where it's like you listen to people who've been in longer and have like more shit done than you, obviously. But like EOD is one of those fields where it doesn't matter. No one's gonna be able to give you good advice. What, what different types of bombs are they? Like, is there like like the diffuse? So you've got like standard like wires, and then you've got chemical reactants. Uh, chemical reactants is usually what I dealt with because they're very easy to make because accelerants that you know how like glow sticks are where you break them in the middle and then the two chemicals mix Yeah, 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 that's 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 usually the types like that but with like uh, Sodium and water or something. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> really? Yeah, is well, that... it, it's it's a more on a complex scale, but yeah Damn. Because usually usually they'll have some sort of unstable explosive literally right next to it and you need some type of a uh, actual ignition to set it off so usually that'll be what it is for lack of better words nothing's ever like timed like you see in the movies it's like literally their pressure plate or motion what's the fucking dingiest bomb you've ever seen um so that that's that's a fun story so it was a pipe bomb underneath like uh the rim well of a car yeah. so it wasn't in a mailbox no, it wasn't in a mailbox. It was literally set so when the tire spun, they put a nail into the tire and a cord into the nail so when the tire would spin, it set it off. Bro, so literally just right. cut the wire and then detonate it. I was born in a Dublin street with the royal drums that <laughs> beat and the loving English feet they went all over us. <laughs> oh wait, you said you got shot and you had to like... Uh, no, I didn't get shot. No, 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 no. That wasn't, that wasn't that. No, so, uh, we did a disposal, right? And I was, you know, proper distance away. Piece of shrapnel comes flying, wedges itself into my arm. Did it hurt? Oh, fuck it. I, listen, being stabbed by God is probably second place. God. It's just instant searing pain. Because it's, like, right next to the bone. <laughs> Never mind. Never mind, we still got work to do. Guten Morgen, Russian Schweinis. Oh my Damn, lord. Yeah. <laughs> you listen to the stream. It's rather easy when it's like dumb. Okay, but what about when it's complicated? When it's complicated, we just detonate it. Ah. Uh. <laughs> and if we can't, then. Then. Yeah. Then what happens? As things get difficult. Uh, then you actually get like a bomb suit and everything, which usually they're in spare regards because they're expensive as hell. They break down often as well, and the Kevlar on the front is really your only padding. The real reason you wear one is because it's pressurization. So, if there's one wire, you just cut it, or you just yank the battery out. Look, yeah. If there's more than one, you just blow it up. <laughs> yeah. Is a bomb defusal suit really gonna do anything? Uh, depends on, like, what, like, level of ordnance we're looking at. What's the biggest bomb you've ever seen? Three 150 millimeter howitzer shells were like piled on top of each other underneath the pressure plate. Fucking Jesus! Someone's gonna get. Someone literally was playing on taking half the block with them. You just step on that, you'd fucking you just disappear. Like there'd be nothing left. Exactly. Of you. It's just the U.S. used to use white phosphorus tipped 150s. I found it, but I never actually worked on it. We called Biochem in for that, and they come in with their hazmat suits and everything, and they work on it. The biggest oh shit moment was in the heat of... They had cleared the area, I was going in to work on the actual, like, IED, quote unquote. And then we started taking fire, so in the heat of the moment, I make a mad dash back towards one of the MRAPs. And, um, guess who lost their, uh, $3,000 rifle that was now gonna come out of their paycheck for the next few months? <laughs> you did? Oh yeah, I never found that fucking thing. But I still had to pay for it. <laughs> <laughs> like, like you know, Supply Depot stuff. boys be like, all right, I heard your child died, so uh, here's what you're gonna do. You're gonna pay double for wasting my fucking dime. <laughs> you're gonna pay me double for hearing your sad sub story. 
<laughs> yeah, pretty much. Supply Depot dudes steal from everybody. You ever worked with other countries before? No, I never did any, like, joint operations. That never really was part of my job description. I don't want to talk to the French! <laughs> I... yeah. I can't even speak French! If you enjoy that, you can see more at my Twitch down below. Uh, and you can subscribe to my... And you can subscribe to my YouTube channel. No one cares, as man. Well. No and, one cares. And listen, all right, listen. All right, my, no, my, no, channel, no, no, my channel. No. My channel. No. My channel. No. Is no, way, don't, don't way better. Channel. Yeah, but dude, like, you should totally subscribe to my channel. You see, you should, get on your knees. Get on your knees. No, you should totally. <laughs>